beginnings And it makes my head spin But they don't feel like ashes Upon the wind Thank you everybody, thank you, thank you. I gave myself a gap year to tour the world and play music as much as possible. And that's all I did for, for an entire year. And so I booked my own shows, just wanted to get started. I only had a year after all. I met this guy called Oliver Stedman, who said, come play this show in Oxford. Um, it's called So Far Sounds. I went into a tiny living room Somehow 60 people were crammed into it, as well as my string players and me playing on the guitar. And I had played the best show of my life. I remember vividly playing my song Mountains and Hurricanes, which is quite an emotional song. It was quite quiet during one moment of the song and someone hiccuped. And because it was so quiet, that hiccup rang like a bell throughout the room and everyone laughed and it was such a wonderful moment. I then toured the States, Latin America, played some sofas in Russia as well, toured Asia and I basically just built a loyal following one living room at a time. One gap year turned to two, another three and now it's been ten years uh, of me still being on my gap year basically. Despite all the odds, uh, especially as an independent musician, I just wanted to do this so bad. I've toured so much, I've been very stubborn and I just kept going, especially when things looked so bleak, especially after the pandemic, when I thought there was no light at the end of the tunnel. The reason I've got this Robbie Williams gig is because someone I met at a music industry conference and he's been incredibly supportive when he was working on this show. He just pushed really hard to get me on the bill. Simple as that, really. I guess it's kind of luck, but it took a lot of hard work to develop that luck in a way as well, I guess. I strongly believe if you can play a living room to four or five people and entertain those guys, then you can play arenas easy. I've played to a few thousand people, I've not played this, but I know when it gets to that many people, you can't really see anyone. People tend to follow the crowd and you only need to convince a handful of people in that crowd for everyone to join in. Thank you.